Hi, I am Nancy Ross, and I am the pastor of the Southern Utah Emerging Congregation. I am here for our children's moment, and I want to give you a little demonstration of how to make a peace dove, like the one I've got here, and I'm going to do that uh, while I talk a little bit about doves as a symbol for peace. Um, in our scripture today that comes from John 20 and verses 19 and 20, Jesus tells his apostles who he has just seen after he has been resurrected to have peace because they are scared. And let's talk a little bit more about doves and peace. I want to tell you a story that comes from the Hebrew Bible with some extra bits from my imagination. Our story is about Noah and his boat. Before the pandemic, I did not understand what this story was about, but my recent experiences with quarantine have helped me understand Noah's story a bit better. It begins with Noah having to go into quarantine with his wife and his children and his children's spouses and all of their pets. And it has to be said, they had a lot of pets. Dogs, cats, hamsters, lions, tigers, and bears. Oh my, it was a lot. They all lived on a boat that Noah built. While Noah was building the boat, it seemed like it was going to be a very big boat with plenty of room for everyone. But the longer they spent inside it together, the smaller it seemed. Initially, the animals were fun distractions from the boredom of being in the boat all the time. Everyone joined in the fun of teaching the animals to do tricks and run around the boat. Noah even got the lion to jump over eight rolls of toilet paper stacked on top of each other. But eventually those games got old and the cats started hissing at the snakes and the bear snored loudly at night and no one could sleep. And this went on for nearly a year. Noah could not get any peace, and he did not know when it would end. Can you imagine it? One day, Noah was frustrated with all of his family and all of his pets. He tried to get away for a moment by climbing out on the deck of his boat. And when he had been sitting on the deck for a little while, a dove landed. This dove was not one of his birds. It must have come from somewhere else. It was the first sign of life outside of the outside world that he had seen in a very long time. Seeing the dove brought peace to Noah's heart. This quarantine would not last forever, and out there in the world was a new life to encounter and celebrate. The dove became a symbol of peace. Today, I have shown you how to make your own origami peace dove. When you look at your own dove, I hope that it will bring you peace as you try to be patient with all of the people and pets in your house. And I want you to remember that quarantine will not last forever and that there is a world out there with new life to encounter and celebrate. Thank you.